All right, so for this video, I'm gonna be replacing the uh, front axle on the 2006 Navigator. Uh, the reason is because the boot has been damaged and I have the new axle. So far, I've, I'm gonna be removing these. I just loosened them up a little and the axle bolt also has been loosened and I just raised the car to make sure you have Besides your uh, jack, you have this, so just in case it fails, you have some other support because you don't want to get under the car without this. So this is how it looks like. So I'm going to be removing it, cleaning everything, and then installing a new one in. Alright, so the wheel is out, the axle bolt is out, and then we're going to remove six of those bolts and we're going to be using the 12 size socket like this which is non-standard perfect fit all right again so this is how it looks like this whole piece is has been cracked all the grease leaked out so i'm gonna after I remove, I'm gonna clean first and then reinstall the new one. I'm probably gonna have to remove this one here so that I can uh, pull on this whole piece so that the axle comes out. Otherwise, mm, we'll see. I mean, I'll just take off those bolts and see if I'll be able to remove the axle without removing that this bolt. All right, so I just loosened out those six bolts. I'm gonna remove them now just so that the wheel, this the whole thing doesn't spin. You need to make sure that it's stationary and I use this bar with a towel just to protect these the grooves so that you can put the balls back on. You don't wanna damage these. All right, let's see if we can take it out. All right, so those bolts are out. Um, but to remove the axle, I'm gonna remove this as well so that I can, like I said before, pull it so the axle comes out uh, and to remove this I'm going to be using this wrench and this socket ten, size 10 so you put the wrench here and then socket size 10 otherwise it just keeps spinning and you won't be able to undo it all right and so it's going to look like so and I'm going to be basically moving this in the opposite direction. All right, so the axle is out. Here's the old one next to the new one. And as you've seen before, this is what's going on. I hear the same thing, just be prepared to get a little dirty. Because this grease is everywhere. Uh, so right now, need to clean it up and install the new one in and that's it all right so then putting everything back is just a reverse process those six bolts over there and obviously that bolt that was here in the middle just don't go crazy if you go too tight I did it once and it just broke I had to replace completely again so this time I'm being careful uh, so we'll see how long this thing is going to last. <sighs> That's it. Thanks for watching.